breath can detect early stage liver disease. If you don't get rid of your bad breath, it could be a sign that something is wrong with your body. Some people might smell a certain way because they have liver disease, says the Cleveland Clinic. But if your breath has a strong, musty smell, like rotten eggs and garlic, it could be a sign that your liver is having a hard time getting rid of toxins, says Nancy Moyer, MD, a doctor who writes for Healthline. This is likely because you have liver disease, she says. This is called breath of the dead, and it's caused by toxic sulfur substances getting into other parts of your body. Lee G. Thomas, MD, describes it as having breath that is sweetish, musty, and occasionally fecal in nature. According to the authors of a Belgian study published in the Journal of Chromatography B, even in an advanced stage, the disease can be asymptomatic for many years. They suggest that breath analysis might be helpful to detect liver disease. Scientists have discovered a biomarker that might be used in a breath test for early liver disease. The researchers feel their discovery is significant because it demonstrates a non-invasive method for detecting early stage liver disease. The liver is at the heart of many key metabolic pathways in the body and, the products of metabolism offer an ideal target for monitoring liver function, and to detect the early signs of disease. Various studies have used blood, fecal or urine samples to detect late-stage liver conditions, but perhaps the most promising approach involves detecting volatile metabolites in breath. Limonene is unambiguously associated with diseased liver. It is linked to the diseased liver rather than simply the diseased patient. Limonene is also known to have a clear link to liver metabolism and health, as it is typically processed by the enzymes CYP2C9 and CYP2C19, predominantly found in the liver. Limonene is a naturally occurring chemical, present in citrus fruits, like oranges and lemons. It's in cosmetics, perfume, cleaning goods, and sweets. Limonene is an exogenous VOC, meaning that it originates from sources outside the body, typically in diet. The studies detect this dietary level of limonene. Limonene is administered and its levels are monitored in breath as a means to assess liver health. A diseased liver cannot fully metabolize limonene. The University of Birmingham in the UK reveals that, high levels of limonene in the breath, might be an indication of early stage liver cirrhosis. Cirrhosis occurs when the liver becomes scarred and is unable to function. It may cause liver failure and malignancy. Currently, the only therapy for severe liver cirrhosis is transplantation. Dr. O'Hara and colleagues carried out their study in two phases. First, they compared breath samples from 31 patients with liver cirrhosis with those from 30 healthy controls. In the second phase, they compared breath samples taken before and after liver transplants. The before samples came from the same 31 patients as in the first phase, and the after samples came from 11 of those patients who went on to have liver transplants. The breath samples were analyzed with a mass spectrometer. For phase 1, this showed that the level of limonene in the patients with liver cirrhosis were much higher than in the healthy controls. The phase 2 analysis showed that the levels of limonene gradually dropped in the transplant patients in the days following receipt of their new organ. Breath tests have the benefit of assessing the general function of the liver rather than a targeted test like biopsy. It demonstrates a non-invasive, real-time method of detecting early stage liver disease. An early detection can be helpful in reversing the illness through medications and lifestyle changes.